Hey, Pastor Ryan here with your Wednesday watering. We are in that season of Christmas as we're approaching Epiphany. It's a season of giving, and we are going to have one more opportunity uh, this coming Sunday for the bread pan offering to give to that Readers to Leaders program in Liberia. We want to reach that goal of $350,000. I think we can make it, and our church has been a big part of that. So uh, I'm going to lead you into a video that my friend John did, and you'll hear from him and some of those voices in Liberia as well. We love you, and we'll see you on Sunday. On the northwest coast of the African continent, you will find a small country of Liberia. It is approximately half the size of the state of Michigan, with about 5 million citizens. It is the first and oldest democracy on the African continent, founded by freed American slaves in 1847. But in 1990, Liberia was plunged into two catastrophic civil wars, which over 15 years killed hundreds of thousands and decimated every inch of this fragile developing nation. Today, half of the population lives in poverty. And this is why education is so important in Liberia. It is a path out of poverty. In Liberia, every school age child is not in school. Families have to pay for not only school fees and tuition, uniforms, and also school supplies, different activity fees. So even at government schools where tuition is free, there are many costs throughout the school year that prohibit families from sending children to school or from sending all of their children to school. Families need to look at their income, which is very, very low. Many families live on less than a dollar a day. And so choices have to be made of which child will go to school and also if a child will stay in school for an entire school year. So in Liberia, having scholarships is the difference between a child completing elementary, junior high, and high school education or not going to school at all. When you educate a child in Liberia, you not only help save that child from poverty, you create the possibility for them to secure better employment and compensation when they enter the workforce. And these educated children often pay it forward, helping to support their families and communities for life. The gift of educating one child can change the life of a whole village. That's why we hope that you will find it in your heart to support scholarships for children in Liberia through the Readers to Leaders campaign. If every church in Michigan offers the gift of just $600, we can send 100 children to school from kindergarten to the 12th grade. Think of how many lives will be transformed. We need to have our children in school so that Liberia will be a country where our adults are literate and where we can make the proper choices to move Liberia forward. Your support to readers, to leaders, will help make this happen. Hello. Hello. Hello.